Hi guys, so I was just on Twitter and I noticed a new RuneScape blog post which is about a brand new game mode possibly being released in the near future. Speedrunning. For those that don't know, speedrunning involves completing an activity or entire game itself in the quickest time possible. And Jagix are making quest speedrunning worlds come to old school RuneScape. Now speedrunning as a whole is an activity in RuneScape which people are already actively completing. So we already have stuff like timers on TOB, on different bosses, on different instances, even on agility courses. And we've got that in-game and also leaderboards to track fastest times. But this also happens outside of RuneScape. We've recently seen the appearances of different speedrun videos appearing on YouTube. So people like Hebox Jong and JCW already doing stuff like Max Cape speedrun series. And then people like Soup who's done Tutorial Island speedruns. But away from YouTube, certain websites are being used already for people to track speedruns and submit videos from everything from all free-to-play quests being completed to the fastest completion of the Prifdinus Agility course. Now, with the release of the blog post, we can see that these worlds are completely separate from current worlds in-game, and with a menu based around individual quests and their own unique time goals, shown with the bronze, the silver, the gold, and the platinum cup. Each quest also has set items for you to start with, so when you begin the speed run, everybody is on a level playing field with items that are needed just for that quest. Meaning that for something like Cook's Assistant, you couldn't go and get the egg, the milk and the flour beforehand and just spam click with the items already in your inventory. And this means players get the chance to show their own skill in their path into each item and find the most unique, fastest ways of obtaining points for their speed runs. And of course, everything comes with its own reward. Being polled currently are different rewards for completing each of these speed runs. So basically when you do a bronze, a silver, a gold or a platinum cup, there will be 320 points in total available for those speed runs. And they kind of come with the trophies in the game. So currently they're polling an adventurer's outfit with three tiers costing 200, 600 and 1800 points individually which are kind of fashion scape more than anything else and they look like they go really nice with a quest cape. A speedy teleport scroll which will change your home teleport animation similar to the room fest animation that changed it to a cow kicking you that will be 600 points and also a giant stopwatch for 1200 reward points which looks awesome. Also there'll be the bronze, the silver, gold and platinum cups that are wieldable in game. I'm going to guess it's if you complete all of the bronze, you get the bronze cup, silver, so on and so forth. So I'd love to know what you guys actually think of if this is a really good idea. Personally, I think it will bring a different player base to RuneScape, people who really enjoy trials and kind of beating each other on leaderboards. I also think in total it will bring a lot of players to these worlds to try and improve on times. I think we've all tried to complete a quest as quickly as possible, and this is now a way that we can vertify it and also say, yeah, we've done it. So guys, let me know what you think of the speed running polls down below in the comments. Also, make sure you help me out by dropping a like. It really helps me move up that YouTube algorithm. And also, lets me know if you guys like the content or not. But overall, have a great day, and I'll see you all very, very soon. Now, face the mighty bison.